excuse the state of everything. What are we doing? We've sold the boat. Dun, dun, dun. <laughs> and we're going to live on another boat. A 57 foot boat this time. Uh, we're going from 62 foot down to 57. But we're going to gain a bit of interior space because we're not going to have one of these anymore. Big 2.9 John Deere tractor engine. Um, as you can see, these engine rooms, good to do maintenance on. Uh, great to do your bits on, air filter and all that, not crouching around in some, you know, cruiser stern or whatever. A little tiny engine bay. Yeah, um, good for that. Crap for this. Yeah, both of us being five foot ten, it's not exactly the best, is it? So, it's probably uh, about five I've foot hit three. My head numerous amount of times, and uh, yeah, it's time for right, change. So the boat we get in does need a little bit of work done, doesn't it? Yeah, it's like a not quite project boat, but um, ish. Yeah, so there's a lot of things that we're going to get done to it. So we'll take you along that journey. We're definitely going to decorate it. Um, it needs new inverter. New inverter, new batteries, um, upgraded alternator. Um, Probably a new paint job. Possibly. Yeah, um, looking at like a, a Van Halen style of... Uh, um paint job if you uh google eddie van halen guitar and have a look at that just a different color scheme there maybe we'll see but yeah we'll take you along on that journey and should be a lot of content coming up yeah so this is the current state of the boat getting everything packed up sorry it's a little bit dark in here hello raven yeah we're not too sure when we have to be out at the minute really it could be any time couldn't it yeah, um, our survey for our new boat is on the 10th of October. So I'm hoping that there's not going to be anything drastic wrong with it. Um, we've got it for an all right price. Let's see what happens. Just before we put the boat up for sale, we actually installed this little fire. What is it again? A um, mini Cyclops. Mini Cyclops. Never been used. Never been fired up, got a little candle in it at the minute. Brand new flu, everything. And the new people, what do they want to do? Rip it out. Got in. <laughs> oh well, it's their boat I guess, isn't it? Yeah. Well, we're going to miss our uh, Steve Hudson boat. Well, I'm going to miss the hull. Um, because they are known for having a very good hull. Uh, yeah. welded inside and out um, made in Tamworth uh, Glasgow Basin right so with regards to a Steve Hudson or a traditional boat um, with the boatman's cabin engine in the middle pros and cons pros easy access to the engine um, they're loud um don't get me wrong they are loud um if you take the stove out the back the back is cold unless you use um central heating or you've got a campfire or something like that um that's about it really i was gonna say it's it's, it's been good to us you know touch wood it's good for the next owner um but uh would i get another one again no no, no way uh, would I get another Steve Hudson again? I probably would, yeah. Uh, but one of the ones with the, uh, the sta the stand at the <laughs> engine at the back. Um, yeah, so like, it's, it's, it's more for height than anything. And um, even though uh, our new boat has got portholes as well, um, we wouldn't mind like a, a bus window. But uh, more to follow on that because we've got hatches that will probably turn into windows anyway on the new boat. But... So stay while we're getting the work done, we've decided to stay at Kings Bromley Marina. Yeah, we decided to, um, uh, when we was... When we very first started, we came here, didn't we? Yeah. And we said we're going to put the boat up for sale, so we didn't want to be... Uh, well, we was on the cop when we first had the photos taken. Yeah, yeah. Um, to put it on the market and have it valued. And it was uh, one of those things where... 
we wouldn't want because uh, the weather's changing um, people having to park you know um, near a bridge and walk down a muddy uh, towpath and then the next thing I then say to them you're not coming in unless you put overshoes on yeah um, and uh, we thought it'd be better to uh, be in a in a marina yes yeah. we did slate Kings Bromley uh, marina uh, a few videos back um, but that's when it had uh, different management, different yeah. uh, company. Um, Aqua Vista has now uh, made the place it's livable, ten isn't times it? it's much way better. better. Way, way better. New management is better. Yeah, yeah. The the, the manager Paul, um, awesome bloke, um, fantastic. New maintenance uh, guys as well. Um, yeah, it's a hell of a lot better. Mm. Hell of a lot better. Um, but we also needed a place because we knew that it was going to get a semi. Um, project boat uh we needed a place where we could get materials close to the car uh yeah. so we've decided to take a winter mooring yeah be easy uh, to get all the work done and everything bit, bit more convenience yeah and... more convenience um being able to have hook up uh because um we've got a stove that's knackered in it um Massive it's, hole in it's it. got a back boiler but it's got no radiators um so there's no central heating yeah so we may have to go down the uh, electric group for a little bit, oh, and there's the cats. That's the cats. Um, hello, Raven. But yeah, there's a lot of bits that we want to get done to it. It's not like it's going to be a complete project where when we move on, we're not going to be able to live. But to get it up to where we want it, there's there's going to be a lot that we need to have going to have to do, isn't there? Really? Yeah, um, we're not going to do it like uh, th this boat. Um, I didn't uh, work last year. Um, it was more of a take time out and um enjoy the boat and then we redecorated it well not redecorated it re did it out yeah, god knows how many times, times. We, like this used to be the bedroom once upon a time and then the bedroom was there yeah and then the lounge was there and then our bedroom's right down at the back so it's been five versions yeah. in 13 months and then because steve's got a little boy as well obviously we have to make sure there's space for an extra bedroom so we've changed it quite a few times privacy bedrooms for those sorts of reasons but it, it got to as, as far as we could get it in a livable state for us yeah we try, tried to um make it fit around us mm. and hence why we're we're changing uh, the boat yeah. uh, to have a little, more bit, room, isn't little bit more headroom um no damn engine room no <laughs> engine room because um, that's another thing as well they're bloody freezing yes they are freezing <laughs> so, um yeah uh we're going to be taking our lithium portable batteries with us uh they're not being uh sold with the boat because they can be used for anything but hmm. that's for another video yeah so thanks for watching please like and subscribe so it helps our channel grow see you next time